Today, I'm going to be becoming a jump ball pro, but I only have one hour to do it because I have to go to a public trampoline park. I have booked one hour and I'm going to go to their video game trampoline system in order to play jump ball. What I have to do in order to become a pro is I have to be all three modes, easy, medium, and hard. I am going to be playing against bots, but the bots aren't like normal bots, which are stupid. The bots are actually challenging. So, let's get right into my experience with becoming a jump ball pro. So how the game works is, it's basically football. You have one ball and you have to try score goals. After you kick for a while, your meter in the center will charge up. So the next time you kick with the meter full, you will unlock this basically like super kick attack, which makes your ball like a rocket for one kick, which gives you a higher chance of scoring a goal. If your opponent um, scores a goal, when your meter is fully charged, you just have to kick it again, your meter will charge again, and then the next time you kick it, it will have that like super rocket thing. You can also get fouls by just standing still and the ball hits you, but that is, those don't do anything. And if you kick really hard, the ball will go flying. And you'll know that when you see the uh, uh, green thing around it. So anyways, let's get right in. Okay, so we're starting in easy mode. Here's the arena. As you can see, I'm the guy jumping, and there is the bot. So, I just hit the ball. Now we're passing it back and forth. Alright. Okay, I almost scored a goal, and I scored a goal, I, and my meter for my super kick thing is fully charged. And there you go, there's a special animation, and I scored another goal. Okay, so he's going to kick it. Yep. Let's go. Almost got it in again, but... Not quite. I kicked it to the side. See if that would do something. No. no. Um, and uh, you, you saw nothing there. Okay, no, nothing happened. Okay. And I just kicked it up. And he literally scored a goal on himself. That, that's how easy it is. Okay, didn't know the super kick, and I won. Let's move on to media. Okay, now we are in medium. This is where it gets a little bit harder. So, let's start. Okay, so I went to the side, and right off the bat, he gets me. I did super bad. And then I saved that goal by kicking it to the side. And then I drew it again. This one's easy, it's just going straight. But then I do a special attack and I score a goal. I do another one, it's 1-1. One, one. He has to kick it twice. He almost scores himself a goal. Yes. And I just keep kicking. My meter is up. And he misses. And at this moment, I was like, oh no. If he, get, if he scores another goal, he's going to win. And then the kick. Oh, um, he blocked it. He, he almost. 
almost gets me. But then I save the goal. And I it's almost like I wanted that one to go in. Oh, that was uh, dangerous. And then I did some super kick. My face was literally in the ball. He blocked it again. He almost scores another goal on me. But he keeps kicking. Kicking. And then I finally score a goal thanks to him. And then I was like, okay, next point wins. This is going to be, this might be a bit hard. So the next point wins. And um, we, uh, it's overtime, which means we can't use our meters anymore. I forgot to mention that in the start. Okay, and then just bounce it off to the side for a long time. Kicking it and kicking it. And then, finally, I get it. Now, in hard mode, I kept losing and losing, as you just saw. Even in one round, I lost four to one. I was scared. I was like, wait, I only have five minutes left and I'm in a line. Oh no. But then this happened. I won with two minutes remaining. I completed my goal. But here's a quick summary of what happened that round. So we start off like normal at the at the arena. Right? We're jumping up and down. Then I kick the ball. He's throwing a side shot. I also kick it to the side. He kicks it up. He's moving pretty quickly. Then he makes a goal won, on himself. I only have two minutes so remaining. Then I do another side shot. Feels like a chance. But then he scores on me. Which is bad. It's 1-1. One, one. I have my punch unlocked. I do that mega punch, but he still blocks it. So, I just keep kicking. And hope for the best. Then he scores on me again. 1-2. Two two. Two. I thought I was due. What the hell is that trap? Feeling like a champion. So, so I just of what continued happened. kicking. I had another punch. I was close to scoring a goal, but he blocked it. I fell down, and I, and he almost scored a goal on me. So he just kept kicking. It was close to shooting my goal. I, I kept, but I kept blocking. Another super shot. I scored a goal. It was two-two. Next point would have won. So, he's moving up a bit, he keeps shooting. I'm going to the side, just kicking and kicking. Then, he's not moving, and I score a goal on him. And that's how I became a jump ball Thank you guys for pro. joining me on my jump ball journey on, to, on becoming a pro. We've made it to the end of the video. If you didn't really like this video, YouTube thinks you'll like these videos. And subscribe up, up here. Anyways, I'll see you on the next video. Goodbye.